Hi everyone, let us discuss this concept, index of a curve or a winding number. So here we consider any closed curve, rectifiable closed curve in a complex plane C. Closed curve that means starting and ending point of a curve must be same. So we have a curve X and we take any complex number alpha. It should not be any on a curve, getting it can lie inside a curve or it can lie outside a curve, but it should not be on a curve. So here we take alpha, then index of x with respect to alpha is calculated in this way. Its formula is 1 upon 2 pi i integration over x dz upon z minus alpha. So this is a formula of finding winding number about alpha or index of x with respect to alpha. But see using our common sense also we can easily find its value. So let us discuss this first example. In this diagram you can easily see x is a closed curve in a anti-clockwise direction, we have two points here, two complex number, you can say alpha and beta. So the condition is those points should not be on a curve. Yes, these points are not on a curve. One point lies inside a curve, point beta lies outside a curve. Then you can easily see that x is around alpha, getting? So that means x takes one rotation about alpha. So that's why winding number about alpha is one, getting? But see beta is lying outside a curve, beta is lying outside a curve, so that's why there is no rotation about beta, okay, no rotation around beta, so that's why their winding number will be 0, right. Let us discuss the second example, so here you can easily see that curve x takes two rotations, it takes, this is a first rotation and this one is second rotation, x takes two rotations around alpha, so that's why its winding number will be Two. But if you talk about beta, that curve x takes only one rotation around beta. So that's why its winding number will be 1. Get it? So let us discuss third example. In this third example, did you notice one thing? That x in a clockwise direction. Actually, we expect in anti-clockwise direction, but we are having in clockwise direction. That x takes obviously one rotation around alpha, but in a clockwise direction. So winding value of that number will be minus 1 since direction is opposite okay so that's why i've written minus sign there okay so make a screenshot of it then we will stop thank you bye bye